ABC4 News at 10 starts now. And welcome to the ABC4 News at 10 o'clock. I'm Emily Flores. And I'm Glenn Mills. Thanks so much for joining us. From your local election headquarters, we are less than two weeks away from the midterm election, and millions of dollars are being spent on one key race right here in Utah. ABC4's Courtney Johns live in the newsroom with a look at the race that's getting national attention. Courtney. Yeah, Glenn, if you watch any TV right now, odds are you have a pretty good idea of what race we're talking about. We're talking about the Senate race with incumbent Senator Rep Republican Senator Mike Lee versus uh, independent Evan McMullen. Now, we took a look at the amount of money that's being spent, and it's wild. We looked at the money being raised over the last 20 plus years for this position, courtesy of OpenSecrets.org, which is a nonprofit that analyzes campaign contributions. 2016 was a record year for fundraising, with Mike Lee raising nearly $6 million and his opponent about $100,000. But this election pales in comparison. We're looking at over $15 million being raised between both candidates. Lee spent the last six years raising money for his campaign, camp raising nearly $9.5 million. But with just one year of fundraising, McMullen isn't far behind raising nearly $6 million. A lot of people are paying attention outside of Utah with some big names endorsing candidates. Evan McMullen used to work for me. Um, he worked for me for a couple of years when I was chair of the conference back in 2015-2016. And, and I, I know Evan and I know, our, I know Senator Mike Lee and I am confident that Senator Mike Lee is the man for this job. When Evan goes to the Senate, he will, he will give Utah to very influential senators and you guys will have a voice and it's your voice, trust me that the federal government needs because you guys know how to get along. You know how to speak to each other. In addition to Republican Representative Adam Kinzinger backing McMullen, actor Mark Hamill is saying McMullen is the force for change. And Lee also seen support from Representative Kathy McMorris Rogers and former Utah Governor John Huntsman Jr. There's a lot of people watching this race. Uh, the Senate majority could hinge on just a few senators. And if McMullen actually won, that would be a historic moment for Utah, considering the state hasn't seen a non-Republican in the U.S. Senate since the 70s. And outside spending might be the most impressive thing. Well, the past years, the most that we've seen is about 850,000 raised by outside, uh, outside groups. This year, it's nearly $15 million. Back to you.